Good morning, everyone. Another day, another vlog. So if you're new here, welcome. So glad to have you. My name is Lena. Um. It is early as hell. So those of you who are real ones on my channel, you guys know that we don't really wake up at this time very often, okay? Did my lazy ass intend to wake up at 5 a.m. today? Hell no. Till the no, no, no. You guys know I love my sleep, okay? So if I'm waking up at 5 a.m., it's for a reason. This morning, I'm attending my first meet and greet with Gymshark here in New York City. And I am so excited because if you don't know, this is actually my first meet and greet. And so my jitters and my nervousness and my excitement was like bubbling up inside me and I could just not fall asleep. And also I woke up super early and I couldn't go back to bed. So full transparency here, that is why I woke up this early. We gotta make breakfast, we gotta work out, we gotta get ready. Very busy day today. Let's go make some breakfast. So this is what I call my lazy girl breakfast <laughs> because it barely requires cooking. Full gym fit is from Gymshark, you already know. We're going for like a pinkish mauve type of vibe. Pre-workout time. Bottoms up. Excuse me. In case you are wondering, I'm taking EHP Labs Oxy Shred in Gummy Snake, one of my all-time favorite flavors. I also added some creatine. I get some questions about why I take pre-workout, especially for morning workouts like this. I do not have energy to work out. <laughs> so this kind of gives me like the extra push. It also helps me last longer during my workouts. And creatine has a bunch of benefits. I'll put a list somewhere over here. If you guys want, you can use my code Lena10 for money off. Never feel pressured to use my code, only if you want to. I appreciate you if you do. I still appreciate you if you don't and you just watch this video. Maybe throw it a like if you're liking it so far. It's upper body day today. I clearly need to work on my upper body a little more. But yeah, we got a pre-workout in. Let's kill this workout. She insists she got more class, we know Swimming in the money, come and find me Nemo, if I was at the club, you know I bawled Chemo, drop the mixtape, that shit sounded like an album Who'd have thought a countrywide tour would be the album? <laughs> Post-workout protein smoothie, fire. So before I go get ready for the meet and greet, I just want to have a little chit chat with you guys. So I don't know who needs to hear this, but you do not need to wake up at 5 a.m. in order to be productive with your day. And I just want to be real because I know that the title of my video too is probably gonna be like 5 a.m. morning routine. But to be honest, I do not wake up at 5 a.m. every single day. You can wake up at 11 a.m., 12 p.m., even 1 p.m. and still have a great productive day. I feel like sometimes when we watch a lot of these videos, you can get kind of down on yourself, at least I do, if I feel like I'm not waking up early enough. I hope what you guys take from my videos is not that you have to wake up at the crack ass of dawn, <laughs> drink your green juice in the morning and go work out right away. That's not what it is. And I certainly do not do that every single morning. Instead of stressing about waking up super duper early in the morning, I feel like at least to me, it's more important to have a routine no matter what time in the morning it is that you wake up. Having a set routine makes me feel so much better the rest of the day because I feel way more organized. I feel really accomplished just getting stuff done in the morning and just having that routine makes me feel good about myself. And as long as you have a routine, that is the important part not waking up at 5 a.m. Okay, but yeah, I really have to get ready. I gotta take a shower, I stink. So off camera, I literally changed seven different times and I finally chose my outfit for the meet and greet. I'm wearing my favorite Adapt Camo Seamless shorts and the Gymshark Legacy Bandeau bra. And I'm about to get ready, beat my face, do my hair, everything. I wanna look cute when I meet you guys. <laughs> I'm so excited. It literally feels like you guys are like my long distance bestie and I'm like waiting to meet you. I feel like I'm one of the smaller YouTubers that are attending this event, but I don't really care if only like two of you show up, I'm still happy. I just want to meet you guys in person and hug you in person.
I am an oily mess. Okay, it is hot. I'm speed walking because I'm running late, <laughs> per usual. I know I'm getting all these aesthetic scenes of New York, but like in actuality, I'm like out here like puffing and puffing. Hello vlog, it's Sam. We are here at the sample sale. Look at Sam's abs, guys. Who's that, guys? Who's that? <laughs> they have all the Gymshark goodies. I'm so excited to meet you guys. Call me a pro photographer. cold in here so it's actually the day after my meet and greet I meant to continue the vlog but by the time I came home I was so pooped out that like I plopped on my bed and I just like laid there for hours it would have been really boring <laughs> but yeah about the meet and greet I have no words other than the fact that yesterday was probably one of the best days of my life Right don't click out okay I'm not gonna cry those of you who came out yesterday like thank you so so much I am still struggling to process the fact that some of you literally took time out of your precious busy days to meet me a couple girls even like brought me presents one of you got me this beautiful vase another girl got me flowers another girl got me this positivity book like what the heck I literally don't deserve you guys Ew, why am I crying right now I'm so sorry. We're good, we're good. Just give me a second. Those of you who are new here are probably like, why the hell is she crying in her video? I promise you, I usually never cry. It's very rare, this is very rare things. Like you watching this video, you mean so much to me. Not a day goes by where I don't think about you guys and where I'm not talking to you guys through the comments. I really don't even have that many subscribers. Like my almost 200,000 subscribers feels like such a tight knit family. You guys are just so positive and so sweet and you guys just like accept me for who I am. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Yesterday I was expecting two of you to show up and I was gonna be happy just meeting the two of you but a bunch of you came out yesterday way more than I expected thank you guys so so much for everything I love you guys so so much Welcome to my bathroom. But I got these super cute dispensers to put in my shower because currently all my products are just like laying out just on the side. Look, let me show you. Ugh, but I just have so many products like laying around all over. I'm homesick, but I'm really craving my mom's fruit plate. If you're new here, you probably don't know about my mom's fruit plates. Basically, my mom's fruit plates are elite. For as long as I can remember, my mom has been cutting us up fruit every single morning. And ever since I moved out, I really miss her fruit. So I thought, why not try to replicate her fruit plate and go get some of my own fruits at the grocery store. Emma, if you're watching this, I know you're probably disappointed because this does not look cute. But it's a good first attempt, you know? Okay. Don't worry, it's pretty. Here, here. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What? I'm not 